Have you ever wondered how one man could create the world's largest contiguous land empire in history? That man was Genghis Khan, a figure shrouded in as much mystery as he is in awe. Born into humble circumstances as Temujin in the harsh terrains of Mongolia, his life was marked by struggle from the very beginning. Yet, it was perhaps these very struggles that forged in him a will of steel. His transformation from Temujin to Genghis Khan, the great Khan of the Mongol Empire, is a tale of resilience, strategy and unyielding leadership. His genius lay in his ability to unify the disparate nomadic tribes of Mongolia, instilling in them a shared purpose and a collective strength that would shake the very foundations of the world. From a life of poverty to creating a legendary empire, Genghis Khan's journey was nothing short of extraordinary. How did a young boy named Temujin transform into the fearsome Genghis Khan? Born in the harsh steppes of Mongolia, Temujin's early life was marked by struggle and hardship. His father, a tribal chief, was poisoned by a rival tribe when Temujin was just nine years old. Forced into a life of poverty, he and his family survived by foraging for roots and hunting rodents. But it was in these trials that the seeds of a warrior were sown. Temujin quickly learned the brutal realities of life on the steppes. He killed his half-brother in a dispute over food, a stark reminder of the desperate conditions they endured. In his teenage years, Temujin began to form strategic alliances, marrying his betrothed Borte, which linked him with the powerful Konkurat tribe. This alliance was a turning point for the young Temujin, setting the stage for his rise to power. Throughout his twenties, Temujin's reputation as a leader and warrior grew. He demonstrated a keen ability to assimilate defeated tribes into his own, creating a diverse, unified force. His approach was ruthless but effective, offering mercy to those who surrendered and annihilation to those who resisted. But it wasn't just brutality that marked his rise. Temujin was a brilliant strategist, pioneering the use of psychological warfare, spies and intricate battle plans. He was able to adapt, innovate and overcome traits that would serve him well as he expanded his empire. In the year of 1185, Temujin was bestowed the title of Genghis Khan, meaning universal ruler. He had unified the warring Mongol tribes, creating a formidable force that would go on to conquer vast swathes of Eurasia. His rise to power was not without bloodshed, but it was marked by an unwavering resolve, a relentless pursuit of power and a tactical mind that was far ahead of his time. From the unforgiving Mongolian steppes to the throne of an empire, Temujin's transformation into Genghis Khan is a testament to his indomitable will and strategic genius. The boy who was once a slave had become a Khan, a king of kings. But what made Genghis Khan infamous was not just his conquests, but the brutal way he achieved them. Genghis Khan, the founder of the Mongol Empire, was known for his ruthless and brutal military campaigns. He didn't just conquer lands, he decimated them. His policy of total war was one of scorched earth and utter devastation. No one was spared. Men, women, children, even livestock were slaughtered. Whole cities were razed to the ground, their populations massacred. The rivers were said to run red with blood. It was a brutal display of power, a message to the world, resist and face annihilation. But it wasn't just about the sheer violence. Genghis Khan was a master of psychological warfare. He used fear as a weapon. Stories of his ferocity spread far and wide, often outpacing his armies. This fear, this terror, was as potent a weapon as any sword or arrow. It broke the will of his enemies before the battle even began. And yet, this brutality was not without purpose. Genghis Khan believed in the concept of Pax Mongolica, or Mongol peace, through conquest and domination, he sought to bring order and unity to a fractured world. His vision was of a world united under one rule, his rule, but the cost was immense. Millions perished in his campaigns, entire civilizations were wiped out. The regions he conquered were forever changed, their cultures and traditions irreparably damaged. The scars of his reign are still visible today, echoes of a time of great fear and destruction. And yet, the legacy of Genghis Khan is a complex one. He was a brutal conqueror, yes, but he was also an effective leader, a visionary, and a man of his time. 
His reign left a lasting impact on the world, shaping the course of history in ways that are still felt today. Genghis Khan's reign was a time of great conquest, but also of great fear and destruction. Despite his brutal methods, Genghis Khan's influence extends beyond the realms of conquest and destruction. The tale of Genghis Khan is not solely one of violence and bloodshed. In fact, his reign saw the flourishing of trade, communication, law and culture, all of which played a significant role in shaping the world as we know it today. Genghis Khan's empire was a vibrant hub of commerce. He established the Silk Road, a vast trade network spanning from China to Europe, which facilitated the exchange of goods, ideas and cultures. This was the first time in history that such a large and diverse area was connected through trade, and it laid the foundation for global commerce. In terms of communication, Genghis Khan introduced the first international postal system, known as the YAM. This intricate network of relay stations allowed messages to travel at unprecedented speeds across his vast empire, ensuring rapid dissemination of orders and information. On the legal front, Genghis Khan introduced the Yasa, a code of laws that sought to instill order and justice throughout his dominions. The Yasa outlined everything from property rights to criminal offences, providing the basis for a structured society. Genghis Khan also had a profound impact on culture. He championed religious tolerance, allowing the people he conquered to practice their faith freely, a policy unheard of during his time. His reign saw a fusion of cultures, leading to advancements in art, science and technology. Despite his reputation as a fierce conqueror, Genghis Khan was also a visionary leader who fostered innovation and progress. His policies and reforms laid the groundwork for the modern world in many ways. Genghis Khan, a man of contradictions, was both a ruthless warrior and a transformative leader, leaving a legacy that still reverberates through the annals of history.